there's some very innate human instincts that cause us to create art. We've always had the need to make. It's invention, right? It's adaptation, and I think humans thrive on invention. I'm Magnolia Laurie, and I am an artist, and I teach drawing at Franklin and Marshall College. It is a way of investigating, a way of experimenting. I would say that it means having a conversation, asking questions. making work maybe goes back to an element of the liberal arts education. At some point I started to realize that instead of writing it in a paper, that in my art classes I could also take all those historical events or philo philosophical ideas or circumstances and nestle them together in an image. general themes in the work and I would say a primary one is the idea of the landscape and I think about it a lot as setting up a mood, setting up a circumstance, setting up a challenge uh, for something to happen there. I teach a lot of introductory drawing and so in that moment I'm trying to teach them to look closely. I hope that they come away feeling just a little bit more attentive to the world around them a little bit better observers, which is incredibly important if you're going to be a doctor or a lawyer or an accountant, you know, to be attentive to the details is an essential skill. The general premise of art is that it's shared. I think that is one of the essences of what I am doing in the studio, investing my ideas into an object, something that will go out into the world. And hopefully there's a few people that have a moment of resonance with it. And in that instance, I am sort of creating a connection, creating a network, creating a web that may not be forever, but it's a moment of connection.